Don't forget to enter the instant nuke skin or any camo of your choice giveaway. To enter, just drop a sub with post notifications, drop a comment down below, and drop a like. Yo, what's up YouTube? It's your boy Bubs here, back with a brand new video. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys a instant camo glitch, something like a camo swap glitch where you guys can put Modern Warfare 2 camos on Modern Warfare 3 guns and Modern Warfare 3 camos on Modern Warfare 2 guns. If this video gets 450 likes, I'll also try my best to find a instant camo glitch where you guys can just instantly unlock the camo. Is it looking to get hard unlocks for the new Modern Warfare 3 mastery camos like Interstellar and Borealis, uh, or play in bot lobbies where you guys can level up your guns and unlock camels very fast or even instant delivery on your guys' stuff then check out mitch cactus their links are down below and they have over 10,000 reviews on trustpilot and use code bubs now this glitch is very very easy to do all it requires is one thing and that one thing is having a banned account now i know a lot of you guys do have banned accounts because about two months ago there was a big wave of bans that went out almost millions of users got banned so most likely someone does have a banned account if you guys do not have a banned account join the discord down below the one that says bubs discord ask around if you guys can try to use their banned account and then do the glitch that way I did like a poll thing over in my Discord yesterday asking how many people have banned accounts and over like 60% of people did have it. So most likely you guys will have one. If you guys don't, then you guys can join the Discord down below and ask around, try to get one from someone else. Let me just explain how the camel thing does work, the camel swap. So for example, we're going to be doing Interstellar. Now the equ equivalent, sorry, to Interstellar on a Modern Warfare 2 gun is Orion. So that slot needs to be unlocked. So for example, uh, let's go over to Borealis. So if we want to do it with Borealis, then the equivalent to that would be bioluminescent if we want to do gold then the equivalent would be gold and gold for that gun or if you want to do polyatomic uh, the equivalent will be polyatomic and priceless so pretty much the equivalent of the camo you guys want to camo swap has to be unlocked on modern warfare 3 or modern warfare 2 depending what camo you're doing let's get straight into it all you guys want to do is go over to private match and when you guys get inside private match you guys want to put the camo not the camo the gun that you want the camo swap on so for example for this video we're going to be putting interstellar onto a modern warfare 2 gun i recommend just doing one gun at a time you guys can do multiple but sometimes when you guys do more than one it does end up crashing so i just recommend one now after you do that you guys want to back out of private match and go over to private match where you hover over it like this on this screen with the second controller add the banned account and then when you guys are it's adding in sorry with the first controller the one that's not banned you guys want to cancel it make sure you guys cancel it fast enough and then the screen is just going to glitch out like this it's going to keep saying loading player stats and eventually you guys want to try to go into private match but it's not going to let you and it's going to end up kicking you to the main menu that's when you guys know you're on the right track you might have to do it a few times it might try to go into private match a few times and then you guys will see right here that it does kick us to the main menu when it kicks you to the main menu all you have to do is load in and then head over into multiplayer When you're on the screen, you guys just want to sit here until the loading player stat screen comes up. Sometimes it might take a while, sometimes it might be quick. It's totally random. So we finally got it. It didn't take that long. And after you guys get this screen, all we got to do is go over into private match. I'm just fast forwarding the footage, but all we need to do now is go over to private match and enter that. Sometimes the first time when you guys try to go into private match, it might kick you to the main menu, which is totally fine. Like right there, it kicked us. All we got to do again is go over to private match and then enter the second time. And this time we should be able to go into private match without a doubt. So the first time uh, it's supposed to kick you to the main menu. So don't worry about that. Now, when you guys get here, go over to the weapon that you guys put before. For us, I think it was the M4. Yeah, the M4. All you want to do now is put the weapon that you guys, not you guys, but the weapon that has the camo, you guys want to swap over. So for us, it was uh, Interstellar. So we're going to put a Modern Warfare 3 gun. Sometimes you might and sometimes you might not get this loading player stats. If you do, it's totally fine. Just let it go through and then select that weapon that has the camo you want to swap over. 
when you select that weapon for us it was the fr you guys want to go over to gunsmith and hover over the camo you guys want to swap over so for us it was interstellar so we're gonna hover over interstellar and now all we have to do is wait for the loading player stat screen getting that screen is totally random sometimes it might be very fast sometimes it might take long for us it didn't take that long so we will be getting it here shortly after this loading player stat screen is done loading, the weapon that's going to pop up is the M4, the original weapon that we want the interstellar on. I'm going to fast forward this footage because it takes about 30 seconds to load up. Now when the M4 does pop up, all you need to do is equip the interstellar and then you guys are done with that part of the glitch. Now the next part is saving it as a custom mod because this weapon is only in private match right now. To save it, it's actually pretty easy as well so let's get into that. All you have to do is back out of private match and then head over into multiplayer and go into your classes. When you guys are in your classes, just wait there until the loading player stat screen does come. Now when that loading player stat screen comes up uh, when you guys are in your guys' classes for multiplayer, some Sometimes it might boot you guys to the main menu. If that happens, then you guys, uh, all you have to do is do the step of bringing the band account in to get the loading player stat screen to glitch out onto your guys' game. You guys will have to do that step again. After that, you don't have to do the entire glitch again because we already got the uh, glitched camos, the camo swap onto our gun in private match. All you will have to do is this step again. But most likely, that's not going to happen. It's just going to bring up your guys' private match classes after this loading player stat screen does finish loading up. It's showing our multiplayer classes but when we select the loadouts it's going to bring up our private match classes as you guys can see our m4 from private match with the interstellar now from here all you have to do is save it as a custom mod so you guys don't lose it and you now you guys can use it in warzone multiplayer all that good stuff after saving it it's that easy guys uh the glitch isn't hard at all all it requires is having a band account that's the only tricky part but other than that this glitch is very very easy to do and very easy to follow just make sure you guys understood the requirements at the start so the first two minutes about a minute to the second minute mark when i uh, explain the requirements make sure you guys paid attention to that because that's also important on how to understand uh, the glitch and what camels uh not what camels but how the camels do swap over and you guys will need the equivalent from for example like if you're doing orion the equivalent to that for modern warfare 3 is interstellar the equivalent for priceless is polyatomic the equivalent for borealis is bioluminescent the equivalent for gold for modern warfare 3 gun is gold on a modern warfare 2 gun it's very simple and straightforward here i'm gonna play more footage of us doing it with the tac 56 i think it's the tac 56 uh, i've totally forgot the name but it is the tac which is a modern warfare 2 gun once again we're going to be putting interstellar on it i'm sorry about the quality of this footage i don't know what happened to it but yeah i'm just going to show you guys more footage so you guys can see that this is a very consistent glitch the only hard part about this glitch is having a banned account and like i said before a lot of you guys should have a banned account because before about two months back there was a ban wave with season three where so many people got banned including me i have like three banned accounts and like i said before i'll probably be giving them away to a couple of people in my next video so if you guys want one let me know down below but if you guys do need a banned account join the bubs discord down below the one that says bubs discord join that ask around and try your luck over there maybe someone can help you guys out with a banned account to not make the video very very long i'm gonna be fast forwarding the parts where the loading player stat screen is coming up now this glitch does work for a lot of the camos some camos might not work someone over on my discord was saying that their polyatomic wasn't working so the equivalent to polyatomic is priceless so that camo wasn't swapping over and then some people were saying that it does swap over so it might be random for every single count but no one had a issue with interstellar so keep that in mind you guys might just have to play around with some of the camos and see which ones work for you but most of them should work we didn't have too much of a problem with the camos swapping over and which ones work Drop a like if this video helped you guys in any way. You guys wanted a camel glitch, so here you guys go. So yeah, let's try to get 450 likes and make sure you guys titty smack that subscribe button. We're on the road to 150,000 subscribers and that would up a ton. We're very close. And also join the Bubs Discord down below. Like I said before, if you guys need help with any of this, uh, people are always helping and sometimes I'm over there helping as well. And follow me on IG and Twitter. All my links will be down below. This has been your boy Bubs and I'm out. Peace.